Yo guys, what is up in a shrimp cup? Welcome back to another video. This is not a Call of Duty mobile video. We are actually doing the Q&A video for today. We have a couple questions loaded up here on the channel. I did actually make a community post uh, about a week or so ago asking you guys to submit your questions and I do have them here. Let me go ahead and pull it up here. We do have some questions pulled up from the viewers, guys. If you do have any questions that you want to ask for the next Q&A, feel free to leave it in the description or the comments below. I'll also make another post when I am kind of close to doing another Q&A. But like I said, guys, 10 days ago, I did ask you guys to post your questions, and here we go. So without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and jump right into this here with the first question from Sirius. They asked, uh, who's your favorite cutting critter? Uh, then also, what editing software do I use? Guys, my favorite cutter is Billy Bob Billy. And guys, I actually use three different software. Software. I actually use three. I'm looking over here as if, because that's where my face cam was before. I moved my face cam over here. Guys, I actually do use three different editing softwares to edit my videos. The first one that I use is called Shotcut. It's a free editing software that you can download. It can run on basically any PC. And I use that for my basic cuts, zooms, and some text here and there. And then once I take that project, I export it, and then I put it into my next program called Film Forth, which is another free program that I use to edit. And then if I need to, I lastly use HitFilm, which is not free. Well, it is free, but you can choose to donate, and I choose to donate. Uh, it's a really good editing software. That last one, HitFilm, I used for a lot of my highly edited videos. So uh, yeah, there you go. Thank you, Sirius, for your... I keep wanting to look over here. Thank you, Sirius, for your question. Moving on, guys, we have a question from Unknown here. And they have a bunch of questions, so let's go ahead and go down the list here. What are your computer specs? Guys, I'm actually going to post an image of my laptop specs right now. I have uh, said this in multiple videos before, but for those who don't know, here are my... I'll probably put them, like, up here somewhere. I keep wanting to look over here. I'll put them up here somewhere so you guys can see. Not crazy. I've actually had this laptop for over five years, so it's a little bit behind, but it does everything that I do here on YouTube. So what's my KD ratio? Uh, I think I'm COD Mobile. And I'll take a screenshot from my stats and I'll put it up there. But there you go. There's my there's my KD ratio. What is your... Oh, shrimp. What's your favorite gun and character skin? Right now, guys, I did actually pick up Mythic Siren. So that is definitely my favorite uh, character operator skin in Call of Duty Mobile because of the jellyfish theme and underwater theme. It matches the shrimp theme. It's perfect. And then my favorite gun is most definitely the AK-47. And I'm not only talking about the Mythic. I'm just talking about in general. It is my favorite gun in real life, too. And yeah. And lastly, from unknown here. They ask, why did you name yourself Shrimp Cup? And this is actually a very interesting question, and I'll try to give you guys the short version of it, but long story short, guys, back in high school, when I was a little shrimp, I believe it was around my sophomore year of high school, my mother was very upset at me because I cursed a lot. And she was like, oh, you need to, you need to think of other words to use besides curse words. And the first word I thought of in replacement of S-H-I-T was shrimp. And long story short, a bunch of my friends in high school kind of caught on and they started doing it too, but then we started replacing other words besides curse words with like shrimp and cup and nut and a bunch of other random words and shrimp cup is just the amalgamation of that. It's, it's the name that I came up with uh, after I graduated high school and everybody just kind of knows me as shrimp. So uh, yeah, that's the long and short of it. It was basically because my mom wanted me to stop cursing, so. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Unknown, for your questions. Thank you so much. You are freaking awesome. Let me go and give these a like as well. All right. And of course, they got the little shrimp emoji. Freaking awesome. Guys, next question we are looking at here. God dang it. I keep freaking what the shrimp. Freaking shrimp. I was going to try to get one question at a time on the screen, but we'll just do this. Next question comes from Blancs, and they ask, who is your favorite YouTuber outside of COD Mobile content and favorite COD Mobile content creator? I'll start with the COD Mobile content creator. Honestly, I like to watch Squally. I like to watch JHC Gaming. Obviously, I really like Iferg. Just super awesome people. And I do watch a bit of Park of the Slayer as well in terms of COD Mobile content creators. But outside of COD Mobile content creators, guys, I actually watch a lot of people. I love watching Mark Plier. I love watching Jacksepticeye. I also really enjoy watching John Wolf. I like Gab Smolders. I also like some other people like Blame Truth, The Codfather, J Bowen the Man, and a couple other Call of Duty content creators as well. So I watch a whole bunch of people. 
Actually, guys, another fun fact real quick is that I actually don't really watch Netflix or Hulu or anything else besides YouTube. YouTube is, like, it's the only way I entertain myself in terms of, like, watching stuff. I don't really watch a lot of movies anymore. I don't really watch a lot of TV shows anymore. I just watch the YouTubers I've been watching for a long time. So, thank you, Blancs, for your question. Moving on to the next one from Savage Killer YT. How did you become a gamer? I remember back when I was a wee little shrimp cup, even smaller shrimp cup back in elementary school. I believe I was in like third or fourth grade. And my first game I was introduced to was actually the Wii game. So like Wii Sports and stuff. But I feel like that's a constant for a lot of people my age. I'm 25 personally. Um, but honestly, when I became a gamer, a gamer gamer is when I would go over to my friend's house and we would play Black Ops 1 and then I eventually actually got into Minecraft as well and that was all during my elementary school years. So that's basically it. I just had friends who play games and I would just play games and I just, I slowly but surely became a gamer over time. So there you go. Thank you Savage Killer YT for your question. Let me like these. There you go. We have a question from, we have another question from Wallow. And I believe this is, they also go by something else. They're in my stream that I streamed today as of recording this video. But they asked, how did you originally get into COD Mobile and why do you stop playing other games for it? Uh, COD Mobile, to me, um, when COD Mobile came out uh, in, in 2019, I believe, I was actually playing Modern Warfare 2019. And so I wasn't playing COD Mobile at the time because I was really enjoying Modern Warfare 2019. However, after Black Ops Cold War, uh, there was Call of Duty Vanguard and, you know, Modern Warfare 2 2022. I really did not like those games. And I mean, obviously, I never played any Call of Duty game past uh, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So after Cold War, I was kind of getting sick of the modern COD formula. And I knew that COD Mobile was a thing. I mean, everybody kind of knows about COD Mobile, but it's just like, eh. So I decided to give it a try. And I believe that was around 2021 is when I really started getting COD Mobile. And I just love COD Mobile so much because it's a combination of all the best of Call of Duty games. It's just amazing. There needs to be a console PC port for it, but uh, obviously besides the emulator, but. And actually, I still play other games too. I play a lot of Warframe on my own time. Warframe is another game I'm thinking about streaming. Uh, Combat Master is another really fun game. I also play a little bit of Genshin Impact too. Uh, kind of falling out of that one. But yeah, I do play a lot of Warframe on my free time as well, so. I don't particularly play nothing else but COD Mobile, but I definitely, in terms of the channel too, like they also might be asking on the channel too, because I was playing other games like Half-Life, Portal, some horror games, Deadly Premonition. And the simple answer is I just get more engagement on the Call of Duty mobile content. And so that's what people enjoy and that's what I'm gonna post. So there you go. Kind of spent a long time answering that question. There you go. And actually, our next question from Monster22522 says, what other games do you play? Like I said, Warframe is another game. Probably my next played game. Super fun. I used to be in Destiny, but obviously once I found out about Warframe, it's just, there's no freaking competition there. Um, and then, like I said, I've been into Genshin Impact before, too. Uh, Minecraft is pretty fun. Um, but yeah, so there you go. Two freaking questions in one. Good tramp. Another one from Reality here. Are you a sweat? Uh, I don't know. I wouldn't consider myself a sweat. I consider myself like a casual tryhard. Like, I'm casual most of the time, but if I need to sweat a little bit, I can. Uh, if I really put my mind to it. But I, like, generally, I might, my COD Mobile account looks like it's a sweat account, but I'm actually really not that good at games, so... Uh, there you go. Thank you for your question. There you go. We have our next question from Samir here. I think... <laughs> What's your ID and password for the COD Mobile account? <laughs> Alright guys, so it's... That was all the questions from the community post. I did actually shrimp. Uh, however guys, I do have some more questions here. Uh, this is also from Reality Guys. They asked, uh, what emulator do I use to play on uh, COD Mobile on PC? I actually use Game Loop. It is the only emulator uh, online that you can play COD Mobile on and not get banned because it is, it is the emulator supported by the devs of COD Mobile, uh, Timmy and Tencent. So um, there you go. There you go. Thank you for your other questions. Reality. Guys, we have another question. This will probably be the last question for the video today. Guys, thank you again for submitting your questions. If you have any more that I've not answered in this video, go ahead and leave your questions down in the comments below. And of course, I'll make another community post when I do get closer to new uh, doing another Q&A. But our last question comes from Rat Bobby Boy, and they said, any thoughts and hopes on what the gun can be? And this is actually from, there you go, guys. This comment was on the video I did actually make about the Lawsuits Tear Crate, and they're asking, what gun do I think it could possibly be? 
Now, honestly, guys, if you ask me, I'm hoping it's going to be an SMG. That's probably the more logical answer or like another assault rifle. But I've heard a lot of people say that they want a sniper and that would be cool, too. I just don't use snipers a lot. I am getting more into using snipers, but um, I'm going to hope that it's going to be like an AR or an SMG. Kind of a basic choice, but there you go. Thank you, Rat Bobby for asking your questions. And guys, that is actually going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and checking out the channel and leaving your questions. Like I said, guys, if you have any questions that I did not answer in this video, go and leave them down below. We're gonna have some more COD Mobile content coming out real soon. And of course, we're gonna have some more live streams as well. So you make sure you guys tune into that. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like, maybe even subscribe to the channel if you did like this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace! Woo! Oh.